Hi all folks, this is Max from GalaxyS2Root.com So I've got an updated uh, review of the AOKP ROM for your AT&T Galaxy S2 SGH i777 I went over a lot of the stuff um, I know uh, some of the things were broken like uh, one of the best features uh, which is when your screen is off you can hold down the power button and your flashlight comes on. Now it works flawless um, the port, this is actually a port uh, from AOKP by um, XDA developer Task650. He's a very good developer. Um, he's, he's updated a lot of stuff that now it's, everything's uh, working a lot better. NFC uh, and all this stuff. Um, so it's working really well. And uh, let me actually show you around um, what I've got here. Uh, let me br let me change the brightness a little bit. It seems a little bit um, not bright enough here. There you go. So it's a little brighter. Um, so let me start with the lock screen. I've got the um, high on Android uh, custom carrier label there instead of my AT&T, which I have AT&T SIM card. And you can see my uh, appointments that I've sp supposed to do this week, <laughs> which I've been so behind. Uh, Google I.O. was last week. Now it's freaking July 4th, so I'm, I st already started pre-parting. So. Um, but you do get the widget locker kind of thing, but much cooler. Um, I get all these eight things. I can go straight to my Facebook, my Google Voice, Apollo Music Player. It comes with Apollo Music Player, by the way. Um, so that's really cool. And uh, also, I've got... Um, I've got a theme going, so it's kind of a reddish theme. I've got, um, what is this theme called? I'll actually show you. But this is all you can do in uh, ROM control under settings, um, general UI. I've got the 180 rotation on, um, so I can use it. Um, also, you can do recent Windows style stock um, or WebOS. I like the stock style, it's the best one. And uh, and also custom carrier, carrier label, that's where you do it. And hold back to kill. Um, let's say you're on an, an app. You're on an app, and you want to kill it. Hold down um, the back button, and it's killed right away. I really think this is one of the best ROMs you can get for your AT&T Galaxy S2, especially now with this new version. I think this is the um, build 7.1, uh, which is you know built off uh, the build for the AOKP official um, stuff. So. It's a really nice ROM. Lock screen is where you can change the lock screen style to eight targets. And you can go down here and choose your favorite apps, customize it, um, just knock yourself out. I really love that feature. And uh, also, um, you can enable your calendar, which is really cool. Um, you know, I can just see my calendar from my lock screen. You can't do this on the iPhone, sorry. Oops, there we go. You can see my. Um, you can also change the colors too. It's br uh, blue, so I might have to change the colors a little bit. Um, also, you can enable multiple events, and uh, you can choose calendar sources. I have uh, my Gmail account, uh, Google Calendar, you know, hooked up to it. And you can enable Fast Source, the one I was talking about. This just comes in handy at night. Um, you're in the garage, and you can't find the uh, the light. It's great. Uh, power menu options. Um, this is just a power menu when you hold it down you can actually add more stuff like screenshots boom it's you know adds it instantly which I like and also you can set the weather widget here um, so your weather will show up in your lock screen um, for some reason it's not showing up right now but but it will eventually um, and also the toggles are really great now with this one you can actually change I don't really like the ICS standard ICS layout uh, which makes it look like that and it's just I like the old old style um, you know that way you can you know do that and also you can customize the uh, toggles that you want to display it all the way here or you can enable all of them you know this is just you know the degree of customization on this ROM is just awesome and that's why I can't really once I get into AOKP I'm just like I love this ROM and plus I I know there's you know other ROMs out there but now nowadays I want to actually you know review ROMs that are actually ones that I want to use I don't want to just review every you know ROM out there so this is one of them and that's why I'm doing my second updates and very good ROM and also I'm running um, SIA kernel on it um, some people say, you know, you can install other kernels like Fluxy kernel or whatever. You can try it. Um, you know, the kernels pretty much determine 
how much battery life you get so you can always switch out kernels and uh, you know the ROMs really are running on top of it so if you want to get good battery life check out other kernels you know what actually I should have a video on that um, so I'm just running see a kernel I like the overclocking on it I usually run it at 1.4 gigahertz even though I can go 1.6 um, it kind of drains a battery a little bit more um, because you're always running and I use uh, smart ass v2 for this one and also you can uh, set it at boot so it sets at boot and uh, you can mess with these if you want to um, so other than that you can also change the themes here um, themes here and I've got the afterburner uh, theme off the Play Store. You can just search for AOKP themes or CM9 themes, and they're all compatible with this ROM. And uh, you can go back to the, the default one if you want to. Um, so great themes, great customization. Um, plus, you get the total, you know, Google experience. Of course, there's no jelly beans for this, but I'm sure AOKP team is working on it. As soon as they pushes out, the, uh, push out those updates, it's gonna, you know, bam! You're gonna have all these customizations plus Jelly Bean, all the performance improvements. Um, so that's gonna be good. And this is something new, Animation Manager. I'm not sure what it is. Maybe you guys can play with it, make a YouTube video, and upload it, and uh, put it as a response to this video, um, so I can learn more about it. Other than that, it runs Android 4.0.4. Again, thanks again to uh, developer Task 650. Um, if you like this ROM, don't forget to donate to him. I always have the credits link in, in my blog post um, at the bottom, and click there, and you can donate there. Um, great ROM, and uh, also it even has AOKP updater. If you want to keep using this ROM, you can check for new versions here. Uh, thanks to uh, Task 650 and Ktune says. And uh, I think that's about it. But I think this uh, the up the new updated 7.1 build is really good. Um, I see uh, most of the bugs, bug, most of the bugs uh, from the previous version gone. And also the previous version I reviewed was actually one of the earlier beta versions. But now it's very very stable. Um, definitely a great daily driver. Uh, this is what I'm going to be using. Also, I'm going to do boot with something else, but. I just love it, and I'm sure you'll love it too. Um, take photos, and uh, let's take some videos. Oops. Okay, there is a slight delay, or I pressed it way too many times here. Okay. Anyway, that was AOKP. I think this is one of the best ROMs. If you want a total like Google experience, definitely go. I know a lot of you ask me what is the best ROM ROM X, and this is one of the best ROMs. Um, now it is even better than ever. So go ahead and try it, and let me know if you have any problems. You can leave your comments in the YouTube or on the blog post, whatever. And also, uh, if you have a Galaxy S2, AT&T, T-Mobile, or the i9100, don't forget to sign up for my email list. As always, at GalaxyS2Root.com, we update you. Uh, once a week with uh, ROM of the Week and also it's a great way for you to get in contact with me if you have trouble with your phone uh, I do my best to get back to everybody and also if you're on YouTube please hit that like button for me it helps me greatly um, subscribe button up here and uh, if you have thanks a lot and use that share button to share this with your friends on Twitter Facebook or Google Plus and uh, I'm gonna actually you know it's July 4th I, I totally forgot and I was gonna work through like this whole week but now you know I you're gonna <laughs> have to take a day off um, so I'm gonna go pre-party and barbecue and eat some food you know and uh, um, hopefully yeah I'll probably be working tomorrow too though so watch out for videos tomorrow too and I'll try to include some of my barbecue July 4th and happy July 4th everybody um, you know it's a great day for uh, people in America. All right, see y'all later. And as always, don't buy an iPhone. You can, you can't do like, you know, you can't do any of this on an iPhone. Look at that, you know. Take that.